We're here at ITU Telecom World 2016 in Bangkok, Thailand. I'm very pleased to be joined this morning by Henrik Milgaard, who is the Vice President for Global Sales for Blue Town. Henrik, thank you very much for being with us today. Thank you. No, it's my pleasure. Now, I'd like to start off by asking you a little bit about Blue Town. Perhaps you could tell us about, uh, about your, uh, your company, your SME, and, and how it's innovative. The way that we are innovative is basically that we have created a solution which is uh, disrupting and will be disrupting the market right now. The problem about connectivity is that with the traditional telco, uh, technology. There's no uh, business case for connecting the rest of the world. So we wanted to, to create a, a business case for that and you know, needed to go and look for the te technology there. So we have uh, created a technology which is so cheap that you actually can g generate a business case for connecting uh, this parts of the world. So tell us a little, little bit about it. Yeah, okay, thanks for that. Um, what it is, is basically a Wi-Fi uh, solution that uh, creates a Wi-Fi hotspot anywhere in the world. It could be backhauled by, by satellite, for instance. So if you could drop it in Sahara, you can uh, actually go on the internet there. You can also work with fiber if, if there's an infrastructure for that. And uh, you can work with a microwave link as well. It's battery uh, backed up and solar powered, so you don't need a grid uh, power. And you've been uh, selling it recently. I mean, you, you, has it? Uh, how long have you been developing it for? Yeah, we, we're developing for a couple of years now, and uh, we are very proud to have uh, projects in India, in Tanzania, and and also currently we are deploying a, a nationwide Wi-Fi for the government of Rwanda. And what's the reaction that you've had to uh, the people who've been here at ITU Telecom? It's World? massive. It's uh, the, it's great to be here. The interest is uh, fantastic, uh, and we can see that there's a very, very big opportunity for replicating the solutions that we do to, to all the, the parts of the world uh, that we are focusing on, which is you know Africa, Middle East, Asia, uh, but also South America, actually. Now, there's been a lot of talk about ICTs supporting the Sustainable Development Goals, the UN SDGs. How do you think you fit in that picture? I'm very proud to say that Blue Town fits very well into that picture. Uh, we are proud to say that we're supporting 11 out of the 17 SDGs. If you just look at the first five, which are, for me, very important, so we, we are very happy to say that we, we will reduce uh, hunger. We are supporting the way that you get gender equality. You can also get a lot of education and, and also health uh, improving information out of being connected. Basically, all the studies about saying uh, getting connected gives uh, Im implications that getting connected isn't self-enforcing for a better life standard. And uh, that's also what the SDGs is, uh, is about. So we're very happy about that. What's the biggest challenge that you face as an SME? You know, being uh, out of Copenhagen, we are a long way uh, from where we're basically operating. So there's a big challenge in that uh, geographically. But uh, the way that we overcome that is basically by partnering. It's very important for us to partner with the local governments, partner with the local uh, engineering companies and, and uh, what have you. So, so that is uh, the way that we overcome that. But of course, it's a challenge. And how is collaboration important to you? Who would you like to partner with? Yeah, but we're partnering with, uh, with the ones that we want to partner with uh, already. And that is the governments. It's like ITU. It's very important for us, basically. Uh, UN and, and other uh, you know, global organizations, that's very important for us to partner with. I think it's also important to partner with the financial institutions like the World Bank, uh, all these, uh, because uh, not all have the, the, the right finances to actually roll out, roll out an infrastructure like this. So that's also very important. And nevertheless, also not uh, forgetting the, the, the local partners on the ground, that's also very important for us. And finally, what's the value for you of attending events such as ITU Telecom World? It has been a uh, big, big and a great value. Uh, the thing is that uh, there's uh, many leaders coming here and many decision makers. And uh, we have had so much uh, contact, good contact and uh, many, many uh, follow-ups uh, that we have to do here. So for us, the value has been tremendous. Henry Mogar, thank you very much indeed. Thank you.